thinks someone sounds very upset. What's the matter, Pula? Come on, tell Mr. C. My friends have forgotten my birthday, and they promised they'd be here to share it with me. It's sad when friends forget their promises, eh, Mr. Z? <laughs> Maybe they're running late. <laughs> No, nothing like a story to help pass the time. What do you say, Bula? I suppose so. I've got nothing better to do. <laughs> I think this story will cheer you up. <laughs> I do too. It's called The Lion's Promise. There once lived a boy who always kept his promises. He was so good at keeping promises that everyone called him Tembisa. Tembisa means promise in Zulu. Hmm. Which path shall I take? Hmm, hmm, hmm. This one, I think. But on this morning, Tembisa took the wrong path. For waiting up ahead Ow. was Lion. Out! I can't get free! Help! Everyone from the village knew that Lion was not to be trusted. But on this day, Sneaky Lion had got himself stuck in the middle of a thorn bush. When Lion saw Tembisa coming, he called out, You! Stop! I command you to help me! Tembisa believed the bush was a spirit who had a special message for him. I... Tempisa, I'm listening. Oh, great spirit, your wish is my command. Good, good. Can you keep a promise? Yes, oh, great spirit. A promise I make is a promise I always keep. Then do you promise to help me? Of course, great spirit. I promise. Good. Then come around this side of the bush mm -hmm. and release me. When Tembisa went behind the bush, he had a big surprise. You're not a spirit. You're a lion. Yes, yes, king of the beasts and all that. Now, boy, help lift these thorns and get me out of here. Tembisa wanted to run away, but the sneaky old lion knew just what to say. You promised, so now you have to free me. Tembisa didn't trust Lion. He was worried that if he freed him, Lion would eat him. Before I help you, please answer this question. When was the last time you ate? I've been trapped here for three thirsty days and I am starving. Tembisa was now sure that if he freed Lion, Lion would eat. Eat him. B well, I'm not sure I should come any closer to you then. You can't break your promise. Tembisa knew that Lion was right. In all his life, uh... Tembisa had never broken a promise. And he couldn't now. Lion, I will help you on one condition. Can you also keep a promise? Yes, yes, of course. I promise, cross my heart, and blah, blah, whatever. But I haven't told you what you need to promise yet. Forgive me. Being stuck in these sharp thorns isn't easy. Ah, what must I promise again? If I release you, will you promise not to eat me? Of course. Hungry Lion promised not to eat him, sir. Would I lie to you? Now, come on. Release me! Hair popped up from an anthill to see what was going on. Hmm? Oh, dear. And oh, because dear, kind dear. Tembisa was so trusting, he began to help free Grumpy Lion. Uh, hold on, Lion. I'll soon have you out of here. This isn't good. Mm, not good at all. After a bit of a struggle, Tembisa succeeded in releasing Lion. There you go, Lion. You're free. At last. <laughs> Lion was very happy to be out of the bush. Very happy and very hungry. Yum. 
<laughs> so tell me, boy, what does human flesh taste like? You gave me your word of honor that you wouldn't eat, eat me. <laughs> Silly boy, never trust a hungry lion or a talking bush. Tembisa knew he had made a terrible mistake. I... I... think I'll be g going now. Help! Oh, I knew this would happen. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Tembisa tried to run away, but Lion chased him down. With one swipe of his mighty paw, he brought poor Tembisa crashing down. Ah, now I've got you. In a flash, Lion was upon Tembisa. Help! Get off! Let me go! Ha ha! Dinner is served! Yum, yum! But before he could eat Tembisa, he heard Hare laughing. Oh dear, the king of the beasts is so old he can only eat little boys. Don't you think I freed him from that thorn bush and he promised not to eat me? <laughs> Boy, you were mistaken. I know a lion doesn't keep his promise. What, the king of the beasts stuck in this little thorn bush? Oh, please! It's true. I was stuck in that bush for three days. Hare tried to keep Lion busy to give Tembisa a chance to escape. But Tembisa didn't understand what Hare was up to. He came over to join them. Never! A lion couldn't get stuck in there. Look, I'll prove it. See? No one could get stuck in such a large bush. It's true, I say. I was stuck in there. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, but I wasn't born yesterday. Fine! I'll prove it! I crept in like this! Hare kept signaling for Tembisa to run away. But Tembisa wanted to see just how Lion got caught huh? in the bush. <laughs> but Lion, you're not even that far in! You can easily get out! I was much deeper in. Look, I'll show you. Now watch! Mm -hmm. Maybe. That might work, but surely you can still get out now. Ah! Ow! Ow! Ouch! Ah! Nope! I'm stuck! Just like before! Ow! With Lion once again trapped in the bush, Tembisa and Hare now had a chance to escape. <laughs> Run away! Run! Now do you believe me? Hello? Hey! Ow! Ouch! These thorns are killing me! Hey! You can't leave me this way out! Come back here Safely at once. back at the anthill, Tembisa thanked Hare for saving him. Thank you, Hare. You were great. You're welcome. You're a good boy for always keeping your promises. But remember this. Never trust a hungry lion to keep his promises to you. <laughs> And so Lion learned the hard way that a promise is something you should always keep. I just wish my friends could keep their promises. Surprise! What? You were here all the time! <laughs> oh dear, you guys! Happy birthday, Pula! <laughs> you tricked me, Mr. Z! Your story was part of the surprise! Mm -hmm. Yes, Pula! We all love you so much, we planned something special. Thanks, I love you guys. Hmm. You're hmm. the best friends in the whole world. Promise? <laughs> yes, Yay. I promise. Promise, 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 promise. <laughs> Zoom.
Sumbaya, 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 S